Omar Kazarski, Creative Director of Bauer Web Solutions. In this video, I'm going to show you how to add a PDF to your WordPress site using WordPress version 4.4.2. One of the most common questions we get asked is how to upload a PDF to a WordPress site and then link to it so people can download that PDF from a given WordPress page. So in this example, let's say that we're going to add a PDF of a manual for an Android phone to this page. So we'll need to upload the PDF into our media library and then link it um, from this page. So I'm going to edit this WordPress page. I'm already logged in. And the way that you add a PDF is, in essence, the same procedure as adding a picture. You place your insertion point where you want the hyperlink to eventually go that's going to point to our PDF. And I click on the Add Media button at the top of this Edit pa Page screen. So the PDF which I uh, wish to add is not already part of my media library, so I'm going to need to upload it. So I'm going to click on Upload Files, I'm going to select the file, and here is my Android manual. It's a PDF. It's 1.8 megabits in size, so that's typical. Usually PDFs can range anywhere from under a megabyte in size to four or five megabytes, sometimes even larger. But again, smaller the file size, the better, because not only will it take less time for people to download, but it also won't increase your uh, web hosting allocated space. Uh, you won't run out as quickly. So I'm going to choose the PDF. I click Choose. There, it's uploading the PDF. So the title, this is what you would uh, you would enter the text of what you want that hyperlink to display. So instead of just saying Android, I'm going to say uh, Android Manual PDF. Okay, so the words Android Manual PDF, it's what's going to be the underlying hyperlink when all is said and done. And the attachment displays, we're going to leave that linking to the media file, which is the web address of the PDF we're about to upload. So all you really need to change is just the title here and make sure that it's linking to the media file itself. So I insert into page. And you'll see here, there's my hyperlink with the words Android Manual PDF and now I'll update the page. And this would be the same approach if you wanted to add a PDF to a post, the same way for a page as we've done here. So if I view the page, I'll see there's my hyperlink, and then if I click on it, it'll either download or in some browsers display the actual PDF here directly within my browser window.